folks. We just had a busy day of cutting here at the 2018 Lucas Oil Super Stakes. To finish off the day, we had the limited non-pro classic final. That was taken out by Chelsea Tatum. Congratulations to you, Chelsea. Thank you. What did you think when you looked up and you saw that big 225? I mean, that's a great score in an open final, let alone the limited non-pro. Um, well, it's my highest score ever, and I still really can't believe it. <laughs> And you scored your highest score ever in the Will Rogers. So mm -hmm. tell us how that feels right now. Um, well, I've been showing here since I was in the pretty much junior youth. So it's really awesome. It's just unbelievable, honestly. So you must feel a little bit at home here if you've been showing here for a long time. Um, yeah, but it's just as intimidating now as it was in the youth. <laughs> So you, it was actually, you know, it was a high standard final. There was a 222 to beat, another good score. What was your plan to do that? Um, well, I just wanted to get my horse shown, uh, cut clean, and honestly, just get through it. I, and it just kind of happened, and it just kind of built. My run just really built. It did. Can you describe that run to us? Do you remember your three cows? Uh, sort of. Um, my second cow was the favorite, obviously, and it kind of got my blood pumping and um, just stayed on it for a long time and it just was really awesome. <laughs> Can you describe to us that feeling you had while you were in that saddle? Um, honestly, it was just like my adrenaline was pumping and I just love this horse, she means so much to me and it's just awesome to, to get to show her through that. <laughs> okay, so Bob Smart Ray, how did you come by this horse? Um, I actually bought her the night before I showed her at the Futurity, which I made the limited and regular Futurity finals on her. I got fourth, I think. Um, and so, and she's just been like one of a kind of horse for me ever since. So you have some real chemistry by the sounds of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, she's definitely staying in the family forever. <laughs> <laughs> now, Lloyd Cox is your trainer, is that right? Uh, yes, ma'am. Okay, what advice does Lloyd give you or that stays with you, that, that comes through when you're going through your run that really helps? <laughs> Um, well, him and Clay are really awesome about talking to me and making sure that I have the right cows and um, mainly this show has been to kick and be more aggressive and just smooth cuts. Okay, so what's next for you? Um, well, she's close to 100, so we have the regular non-pro finals later this week and then um, probably the BI. I'm just trying to... Just trying Okay, um, you've won 9,000 tonight, so that will help uh, boost yours as well. I think you've won, what, 68,000, is that right? Probably, probably almost as much as <laughs> So is this your biggest check so far? Um, well, maybe, yeah, I don't really know. <laughs> don't keep track of it the too much? Paternity, the paternity definitely was. Um, it, was um, it was awesome, so that was, that was a really fun thing. She's just been fun ever since we made finals, and... She's just taking care of me really well. I think she's telling you she's done. She wants to go home. <laughs> yeah, she is definitely very, um, she's not shy about her feelings. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, congratu uh, I should say good luck with the, the non-pro and congratulations once again. Thanks for joining us. Okay, and that finishes everything up for tonight. Join us again tomorrow for a full day of amateur finals. You can watch it live on the CHC webcast. Good night.